Welcome to the Showstopper Shows. I wasn't expecting that. Thanks, Show Sparkle. What up? It's what I do. Today, I'm reviewing mocha iced coffee in a bottle. I'm gonna raise the glasses for the masses yet again in my third of four videos where I review the new Dunkin' Donuts iced coffee in a bottle. So I went to my local Kroger, walking down the uh, beverage aisle where they had them chilled in the nice coolers and saw a whole row. And none of them were missing from the row, which I'm thinking maybe I'm the first person in the world to taste these. And as you can see right here in the nutrition information, 186 milligrams of caffeine and that is by far the most so far in these that I've reviewed. Um, it does have 14 grams of protein and you can see it has 47 carb, uh, carbs in the bottle plus 290 calories. So that's your nutrition breakdown. Again, this is mocha. So let's go ahead and raise the glasses for the masses, guys. It's where the fun begins, as usual. All right, so remember to eat and drink things that are good for you in moderation. The food and drinks less longer, so will you. And that's what we all want. Here's Showstopper Land Population. Everybody in the world. Shake well. Shaken, not stirred. Let's go ahead and bottoms up on this one, guys. Chocolatey. Almost. That just reminds you, chocolate milk. If you like chocolate milk, you're going to like this mocha. It's already chilled. It's already cold. Plus, you get the huge shot of caffeine in here. A 12-ounce Red Bull has 114 milligrams of caffeine. So this... Dunkin' Donuts Mocha drink has 186 milligrams of caffeine. It's 13.7 ounces, just a little bit more. And it's about the same price as Red Bull, $2.59. Again, they've done a great job of mixing the sweet and the flavors with the coffee because I can still taste the coffee in this beverage. Plus, I taste that chocolate flavor, and that's all coming through the essence of chocolate and the awareness of coffee mixed with that milk and I'm getting an amazing blend of iced coffee goodness. Pour over ice. Just tasting it in this in my glass too. That tastes great as well. I'm gonna rate that a showstopper sizzle. Sizzle, 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 sizzle. And that one I'm scoring a little lower. I don't know why I just it's not as good as the other two but still very good. I'm gonna give that one overall an 85 guys 85 for the mocha iced coffee from Dunkin' Donuts. All right, if you would like to be in one of my videos, all you have to do is send a, a three to four second video of yourself saying, may the force be with you, the show stops here. Email it to me at the showstoppershows at gmail.com. The link is in the description below. I'll also have a link to your channel if you have a cool YouTube channel. If not, I'll still put you in there anyway. Hi, my name is Paul. May the force be with you, the show stops here. That's all you have to say, and I'll put you in one of my upcoming videos. I think it's something fun to do. I have a few that I've done before and I haven't done one in a while, so I'm excited to try and do one again for you today. May his presence be with you. I always put a bow on this video because that is a wrap. Press next to go to the next video if you're interested in seeing the very last one, which will be the espresso review. And I'm excited to do that one. I say that one for last because that one could be my favorite drink of all. May the forks be with you. The show stops here. Yeah.